Hey everybody, how's it going? It is Axel Graven. I'm back with more reactions with an X, this time here to bring you another episode of Tacked Up Destiny. For those who don't know, I really enjoy this series. It is a fun series about music, but last episode was really sad, man. And I think they did a pretty good job on it. Obviously, it was pretty telegraphed. You knew it was coming. But I think it's a testament to good stories that we watch them again and again and they remain our favorites. Not always just because of nostalgia, but also because a good story is still good regardless of if you know the end of its plot, right? Granted, sometimes those plot twists and everything make stories better and, and draw us in. But then later you think back and you're like, man, that was a good twist. That was a good... Right, and the second time you watch it, you're like, I know it's coming, but man, it's still good. And then, like, the eighth time, you're like, all right, never mind. But this is a really good show. I enjoy all of the great technical aspects of it, as well as what I feel like is a pretty good story and flow. I do think it could use a little more action, but I think that's just my personal preference. I think a lot of people will find this totally just on their level and awesome. And then other people who like more fighting will be like, and eh, not for me. But man, I just can't, can't get over the pure animation level, the art, always beautiful, the voice act, like everything is just on point for this show. It's honestly so far got a heavy, you know, part of my vote for uh, anime for 20, anime of the year for 2021. I don't even think it was up for it because obviously it came out right at the end there. It hadn't had a lot of time, I think, before anything. But that's just how I feel. There's obviously other really great anime, but I like this one a lot. With that said, thank you guys so much as always for watching. If you do enjoy watching with me, remember to support the original content creator. Actually, just do it anyway. Just do it. Help them, because then I get to see more great stuff. No, but you should do it if you enjoy watching this show, because if we don't support the original content creator, they won't make more great stuff. And yeah, you know, I, I, I don't want to take too long on my spiel, but Thank you for everyone watching, whether it's Twitch, YouTube, or Patreon. You mean the world to me. And, you know, uh, if you want to chat with me, you're always welcome to hop in the Discord and hit me up. I'm always slinking around and happy to chat with people like you guys who are chill. So let's go ahead and get into this next episode. And, yeah, we are bueno. I think we are, at least. Oh, cryogenic state. Oh, and find a way to cure them. Ooh, that's a long time, yo. Years and decades. Oh, I forgot I finished my hot chocolate. No. They're dying. Okay, he did go hard then. It was almost too realistic. He didn't get enough anime main character plot armor, bruh. He got like none here. They were like, fuck this dude. Anything I can. Damn straight. Oh no, if you talk to them, they'll say no and go fight. And intro? Oh no. Who? Diffie? Is that under the city? Yeah, right. And this guy. Is that how he does it? Is that why he's the f man? What the hell? Okay, I wasn't expecting it to pop off that fast, bro. Goodbye, people of the world. Damn, this went a little fast. Is this a limited time series? Is this the the only season? Whoa, and that's how they spawned too, huh? They came out of the crystal. Whoa. The noise is nice. It's gross. It's like a gross noise, you know what I mean? Maybe that's just me, you know? But... Oh, 
Oh, were they there? Shit. Oh, now they gotta go. Oh, shit. They got big fast. Oh, hey, other music arts. Ooh, interesting. Okay, cool. Ice gun. They all look pretty stunning. But it's not just the eye makeup. They have, like, very little visual distinct things. Wow, there's a lot of shit going. Oh, hey, they're doing okay. This series, you never know, man. They could have rocked somebody. Ooh. Hide. Y'all ain't warriors. Oh, she's gonna hide her. That's fine. I guess she is a fighter. Still, I don't know what you guys can do against these D2s. I thought they were kind of like balling, you know? <laughs> He's such a brat. They're not endearing at all. They really aren't. They are 100% uh, like meh characters, kind of. So pretty, though. Oh, Lord. These things are so weird with their, like, one arm, like, all big, one arm small. It's like me on... Mm, well, let's not talk about it. <laughs> Oh, I wanted to see their life cycle. Oh, she, she had to ditch the chair. Is that actually... I mean, I don't know. Probably quite... I, don't know. I have no idea. Oh, maybe they just couldn't get past an area with the chair. Is she wearing heels? That's what it sounds like. No, like booty boots, right? Or like... What are those? They do have some bigger heels, though. Maybe it's because I'm wearing the... uh Hat. Might be muffling the sound a bit. Oh, they're even weird. Oh, no, this is another one. They have so many different types of these. For having so few episodes. You get, like, two an episode at this point. Oh, I didn't know they could do that. Hey, and th oh, it's her! Walker? Right, she's supposed to be a, one of uh Wal Hey, I was I picked it up, but I was I was right in my lo my idea of what it was, but not how to pronounce it, because I suck at pronunciation. Oh come on man. There's no time for dying. We need at least another couple episodes. She didn't leave him behind. Oh, his arm is done, done, huh? Ooh, sh right. She needs a uh... shit. So does so does uh, Titan, right? Oh, that was pretty strong. To be fair, they are a lot of, like, aren't those the littler ones? I just noticed she had those, like, ears, or whatever they are, on her head. Hey! Yeah, what? It's a weird, like, kind of, like, crab thing, but then its legs are, like, tentacly. So this is how he gets it. He's got the third one now. Nice. Quick, but nice. I will say it wasn't as spectacular as some of theirs are, but I think they might be saving it for another uh, battle this episode. They still got a budget, these, man. No matter how much they sink in, there's there's a budget on each episode, you know? Mm. Oh, interesting.
do oh really I didn't see that one coming. <laughs> I have no idea why I just kissed you. <laughs> She'll figure out something if he's breathing. <laughs> Importance of music, just saying. I like that nod to the where they were like, boom, and then she's like, I don't even know why I'm doing this, and I'm like, I accept that. They referenced it. I accept that honestly, because I'm like, I don't need, I didn't get that either. But at the same time, it was like, oh, this is bad. Uh oh, she's gonna kill herself? What the hell? Both? Both! I mean, saw it coming because of the way they were like acting and looking at each other and stuff. Well done. What the f- I'm so confuzzled. Is this their final form? We couldn't handle them before. How are we supposed to handle them to combine heaven and hell? Oh, man. Oh, man. We didn't get enough level ups for this fight. We need to go grind. We need to go grind, boys. Orpheus. Ah, oh, fuck. I still don't understand now. Damn, they did that one well. Now, that was the scene, by the way, that they were saving all that shit for. It was just, once again, they do these little clippets of Ash's very interesting style. Not Still not sure if I'm a fan of it, but man, is it interesting to see different things done. And I think that's, honestly, one of the best things about this is it's not just the, the high level, but they've also taken some, like, movements that are a little different. Because I think if it was just a everyday shonen story, it would not fit all the other, like, kind of hoity-toity fanciness of the series, right? No, like, disrespect to other series, but I think, like, series have different, you know, uh, art styles and stuff, not just because the artist can draw that way, right? A lot of manga artists who don't draw the most complicated things are still very good artists. They Their series lends itself to an art style. Oh, shit. Lost the cam. Right? And because of that, it's like, yeah, uh, they're going to draw it a certain way. For example, Shin-Chan is f really funny because it's drawn that way. If it was super realistic drawings, I don't think it would be nearly as funny. I also uh, have talked about that for like One Piece and a bunch of other series where like the art style matters for what you're doing, right? It's why a lot of horror is done in more serious, like... Def, like defined realistic stuff because that lends itself to the style and like oh right I'm supposed to okay shit it lends itself to the style and the enormity of it and all that good stuff uh, I guess I'll have to remember to edit that out but hey I've got time this week because once again we're short one but hey I, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this week was very interesting that last little piece threw me off quite a bit especially the kissing thing that was like out of left field for sure at least in my head because i was like they've been setting up kind of like you know destiny intact not necessarily her but i think it was one of those ones where she's like been growing up with them and right the, the whole time and i don't know it, it's an interesting one and because they explained it where she was just like I have no idea why I just did that. I was like, I, I accept that. If she doesn't know, I don't know. Like, that's out of character. And she feels it. I feel it. That's fine. It was weird because I was thinking about in-character actions and things that make sense and things that don't make sense. Because I think that's a lot of what makes a great character-driven story. And this is a very character-driven story. Is why do the characters do what they do and what are they thinking when they do those things, right? Uh, and so for, like... 
protect is all you know when he goes off and blows his whole fucking shit and falls over i don't really mind because he's an idiot he's done that consistently he's not learning anything he doesn't seem to plan to for that particular right like he'll just go overboard and he didn't give two shits tell afterwards <laughs> when it when it almost kills him but yeah and that's fine because he's not trained he's not it would make a lot less sense for like someone like sagan or i guess to do shit like that or or like lenny if he had he wasn't already on the edge of things which he was I, like i said i think they've done a really good job uh however i'd love to hear what you guys think i love to chat about these shows more than anything and reminisce and talk about my favorite parts of shows especially things like this baki etc and so for uh for that if you want to come chat with us in the discord you can you can come and watch us live on twitch we do these every week on sundays you can catch us at twitch.tv slash reactions with an x that'll also be linked and uh you know if you you really want to support us for as low as a dollar a month on patreon you can get access to these full episodes full audio full video no cuts and usually early access a couple days at least sometimes even more if you are a, a five dollar patron you can get up to a month's early access on some of these episodes as well as movies sometimes we do movies yeah sometimes but thank you for watching i really do appreciate it for anybody who did i hope you have a great new year and you know be safe but also you know have fun so thanks for watching i'm max the great this has been reactions with an x hope you guys have a great 2022